Hi, I'm Nadine Dorries. Open the fridge. Whoa, what's that on the cheese? It's culture. Tomorrow sees the great nation of Britain heading to the polls to vote in the council elections. Now that's what I call council culture. As your minister for digital sports media and couture, I'm here to tell you you have one choice. Vote conservative. Here are the top three things your Conservative government has done for you. Number one, the bus pass. Yes, in 1973, your Prime Minister introduced free bus travel for olds. Travel for free and keep warm the fun way. You're welcome, United Britain elderlies. Number two, Brexit. Without the hard work of our Prime Minister, we wouldn't have the excellent thing that is Brexit. Brexcellent. Yes, without Brexit, there would be no vaccines. Over on Europea, they have no vaccines and everybody is also in lockdown. Here, we are all free and nobody has COVID. Also, without Brexit, the shelves in supermarkets would all be empty because that is life under communism, aka no Brexit. Luckily, our supermarket shelves are full of well-priced produce, thanks to our dear leader, Prime Minister, and of course, Brexit. Number three, food banks. Before this government came in in 2010, do you know how many food banks there were in the UK? Less than a hundred. Put it this way, babes and huns, there are currently more food banks in the UK than there are McDonald's's. That's right, in just 12 years, this government has made food banks go from under 100 to over 2,000. Put that in your pipe and smoke it, all the people who say this government doesn't care. So vote Conservative, because a vote for Labour is a vote for Keir Starmer, who it turns out was having a beer and a curry with a man who died in 2019. He did this when? In 2015. Yes, that's right. Just five years before a deadly pandemic came in, he was already flouting the rules. Vote conservatory.